some ways it's a more simple version of what we did last year. There's much less production goes into it, but it's still fantastically dramatic, fantastically exciting. And it is all around the world. I mean, really all around the world. Mozambique, Switzerland, Croatia, Spain, France, New York, Colorado, Canada, twice. I mean, just forever, around and around and around the world. I think my favourite part of the, of the season is, is a mini special we accident, accidentally made uh, in Mozambique, where we genuinely set out to do something very worthwhile and Bono would love us for it, and then made a complete hash of it. Not, I mean, really not on purpose, there was nothing you can do. You're up against the wet season in, uh, in Mozambique. We were in completely inappropriate cars with idiotic ideas. Um, and a, and a really great piece of television resulted, I think, I hope. I hope everybody loves Mozambique as much as we enjoyed making it. Turns out you can't get bored with watching Richard Hammond fall off a motorcycle. First 20 times, it's hilarious. The next 20, it's getting a bit boring. I'm, I'm 50 after that, so he's fallen off his motorcycle again. Um, but no, it's, it's, well, it's us three. It's us three. My favourite car of the season would be the, probably the Bugatti Chiron, but then it would be because it costs like two million pounds, three million dollars, you know, huge, hugely expensive thing, but what a machine. Um, least favourite? We haven't, we haven't actually done any really bad ones, kind of on purpose. Why, why clutter up somebody's evening with a really terrible car? I mean, why would you do that? It'd be bigger and better. The key things are still there. The amazing destinations, journeys, challenges, cars, right up front and centre. The production values. Visually, it's still a feast. And there's still us three elderly idiots arguing. That's all you need. The joy of making the show the way we do it is, you know, with some of the big journeys that we undertake, we have to build a structure for it. And when we're dealing with cars, we've got to hit those points, we've got to get that information across. There are plenty who watch the show who need to know that we're accurate and right when we're talking about cars. Likewise, the best bits are always those bits that just happen naturally and organically, they just unfold. We can't plan them. One of us falls over, crashes, forgets what they're doing. Those are the bits that people enjoy. We know that. My favourite thing from this season probably is what turned into the special for this season, which is a trip to Mozambique. I was on a bike. Um, and it's just, it's a crazy journey. We shot it in almost a new way. It's very visceral, very real for us, and you see us struggle. You do see us have a hard time. Um, I think it shines through as something a bit subtly new, and, and it's really exciting. This ended up as a great film. I hope people enjoy it. Well, it's a launch party. Uh, the new season is about to start. I mean, it doesn't really start because it's streaming. So, you know, it starts to be available from tonight. This is our launch party, this room, which has interesting old and fairly new cars in it, a bar and <laughs> clever things like serving utensils in toolboxes. See what we did there? This is going to become a big party scene just after we watch the first episode and we will do some of this. I love it. See, we're British. We're used to sort of, you know, shivering in dark, damp houses with tiny windows and looking out onto a fog. And here we are, we're in New York with its fantastic you know, skyscape of glittering lights and the razzle dazzle and the, you know, it's just fantastic. We've never done this before. Well, we've been to Mozambique, we've been to France, we've been to America twice, three times now. We've been to Canada. I've already said Mozambique, haven't I? Yeah, uh, which one? Switzerland, we've been to, I've been to Spain. Uh, Jeremy went to Spain on holiday, but tragically got pneumonia. Um, we've been all over the bloody place. The one that I found most amazing was probably Mozambique because it's a, it's a beautiful country and it's um, it's very poor. Obviously, we can't deny that, but it's it's hospitable and and it's, it's just it has a very nice, warm, lovely feeling about it. But it is quite challenging. The infrastructure is poor. The roads are terrible. But it's nice. I loved it. Thank you.